Private Eye Popeye is quite an adventure. This is an animated film from 1954. It's directed by Seymour Nigel and Thomas Johnson and written by Isidore Klein. And we have a voice cast including Jackson Beck, Jack Mercer and Mae Questel. And Popeye is a private eye. And Olive Oil calls him to get him to look after uh, a jewel, a gem. And... Unfortunately, something happens to this gem and also to Olive and Popeye has to try and retrieve it. And he ends up going, well, to many, many different places. I don't want to give it away too much, but I will say there's a lot of international travel involved. And I was very impressed. It's obviously quite far-fetched, but it works really well and it's very surprising. And it's definitely got this strong sense of where will we end up next? Where could we possibly go to next? And a lot of the places are, are quite surprising and they managed to pack a lot of action into a very short space of time. It's also really interesting to see these different locations being animated. Not that there's a tremendous difference in the animation between them, but it's still really good fun to see. Popeye looks brilliant in the outfit that he's wearing. It's a very kind of classic uh, private detective outfit, but it, it works really well. And I thought it was a really fun narrative. In general, I'm not that bothered about stories that revolve around the theft of jewels. I genuinely don't care. But with this one, it was it was really good fun. Popeye really suited this role. I really got a strong sense that he was determined to get this jewel back. And, and it was uh, very entertaining. Probably not my all-time favourite Popeye cartoon. Probably not even a list of top five. But that being said, everything about it flowed well. The animation was beautiful. The character Popeye was playing was pretty great too. So if you haven't seen it and you're a fan of Popeye, then Private Eye Popeye is definitely one that I'm very happy to recommend.